you have got to check out this MPP charge controller from Lead Time. If this is your first time doing solar or if you're experienced, this thing is a beast. It may be the last charge controller you ever buy. And if it's the first one you buy, you can't go wrong. Let's take a closer look. Once you get bit by the solar bug, it's really hard to stop. And inevitably, you're going to upgrade from 12 to 24 and maybe 48 volt systems. So then you end up with a big box of spare parts as you upgrade. But what if there was one device to rule them all? What if there was one charge controller that could grow with you as you start from a small 12 volt system and then move to 24 and maybe to 48 volts? This lead time MPPT charge controller is that system. This is really, really amazing. It's got fantastic specs at a great, great, great price. So let's go check it out closer. As you can see, this sucker is a monster. This is the biggest charge controller I've ever laid my hands on personally. It's 11 inches across, 8 inches wide, and 4 inches tall. So it is a beast. But with that huge size comes huge, huge, huge specs. This thing will do any battery system from 12 to 24 to 36 to 48 volts. So this can definitely grow with you. As it says here, it's a 60 amp controller. So that means you can take, it will take 900 watts at 12 volts, 1800 watts at 24 volts, 2600 watts at 36 volts for a golf cart, or 3200 watts at 48 volts. That is incredible. So since it will do anything from 12 to 48 volts, as I said earlier, this could be the first and could be the last charge controller that you ever buy. As you grow from a simple 12 volt system into a 24, and then if you make the hop to 48, you don't have to keep replacing components like my junk box out in the garage. Maximum solar input voltage is 150 volts. So you can string three to four panels together, depending upon their output voltage, and then you can parallel them if you need to. We've got a max load output of 20 amps here on the load side, which is very rarely used, but you've got that ability. And it will take a really large wire. This is a four gauge. It's recommended up to a six and it's tight on a four, but I can get a four gauge wire in there, which I definitely would recommend either a, 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 an eight or a four. I can just barely cram that in there. And this unit has got Bluetooth in it, so you can monitor the output from your phone. Let's light this thing up. So we've got the thing booted up. It sees my battery voltage just fine. So we got the app installed on my little tablet here. So uh, lead time solar. We show battery voltage. We've got historical data if I had the thing plugged in. We've got historical data that shows the trend line of the battery. Total running days, amount of power use. And we can check parameters in here if we need to. We're at 14.4 for our uh, on voltage. So we've got, uh, got 14.4 for charge voltage here. So I can see everything I need to see from here. So I can check on my phone or on a tablet, you know, what the, what the charge controller is doing, what my battery is doing. Um, turns short circuit protection on and off. Check at the temperatures. So I've got a really cool amount of data here uh, just right at my fingertips. This is really neat. And that Bluetooth is built into the charge controller. It's not a separate plug-in module that you've got to plug into the serial port. It's included. That's a $50 piece with other brands, and you've got it built in at this in this amazing unit at this incredible, incredible price. So absolutely, absolutely incredible. Get a little goodie bag full of parts. We've got these ferrules to crimp down. Looks like a, an eight or a six gauge 
uh, into something a little easier to deal with inside these pins. We've got the standoff brackets. So you can raise the thing up for a little better airflow underneath, even though you do have mounting holes here along the side. We've got screws. We've got bolts for the standoffs over here. We've got molly mounts. We've got heat shrink tubing. So they're really setting you up for success here. The best part is that this beast is currently part of Lead Time's autumn sale. This thing is on sale for $190. My 40 amp rich solar unit was about 150, 160 bucks. On top of that, I got a discount code down below. So if you're just getting started in solar or you're looking to expand and grow your system into something bigger, this might be the first, this might be the last MPBT charge controller you ever buy. I, I can't imagine me ever needing anything any bigger than this. And I love that I can expand from 24 to 48 volts. Check out my video over here about going from 12 to 24. So now I've got something that can grow with me and expand. And if I decide to bump up to a 48 volt system, I don't have to buy anything new. So I'm really, really, really excited. This thing is huge. It's got these great big, huge power terminals. It is heavy. It is big. I'm going to have to rearrange my power carts, but I'm really, really excited to have this in my inventory. So really, you got to check this thing out. Catch it while it's on sale. Check out those discount links down below. And this is an amazing, amazing MPPP charge controller uh, with just uh, amazing specs. It'll take so much solar input and you know you can really kind of do what anything you want to it. So uh, check out the MPPT 60 amp all volt charge controller from Lead Time. Thanks and we'll catch you on the next one.